Just got a new SSD for your PC or laptop? Congrats! Let's make the most of it. Here are five tips to optimize that new SSD. Hey everyone, my name's Trisha Hirschberger and you are watching DIY in 5, the show where we give you all the tech know-how you need in five minutes or less. Today, we're sharing five tips to make the most out of your new SSD, so let's get started. Tip one, leave some free space on your SSD. This may seem counterintuitive considering you just bought this drive potentially to use up all that new capacity. However, leaving a minimum of 10% free on the drive for general maintenance and OS background operations will go a long way in terms of your speed and user experience. It will also increase the longevity of the SSD. Tip two, utilize the Kingston SSD Manager or KSM. It's a great tool for monitoring the health, status, and disk usage of your SSD. It also helps you update the firmware or securely erase data if needed. Having a good understanding of the health of your drive can help you identify potential issues before they start. On opening Kingston SSD Manager, you'll see an Acronis tab. You can only use the Acronis True Image for Kingston software if you have a Kingston SSD installed in your PC. Acronis is software that offers drive cloning as well as ransomware protection. Tip three, ensure everything stays cool. Keeping your PC or laptop cool is important for overall system health and performance. And keeping your SSD cool can be particularly helpful to increase the drive's overall lifespan and allow the drive not only to reach max performance, but also to sustain high performance over longer periods of time. Some drives, like the KC3000 NVMe M.2 SSD, come with a heat spreader to keep your SSD cool, and specifically for gamers, the Kingston Fury Renegade SSD with heatsink is a great choice for long gaming sessions. Tip four, watch the shutdowns. Try your best to never force a shutdown of your device. Unexpected or forced shutdowns have the potential to corrupt any data you've stored. Tip five, Routinely back up your data. Any errors can compromise your valuable information. Format that drive and restore everything safely. Special note for those dealing with data center SSDs, know that the same hardware preservation methods we've discussed today for personal SSDs will also help improve the longevity of enterprise data center SSDs. <laughs> there are many things to consider when installing and managing a new SSD in your system. If you find this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and share with a friend. And we'll see you next time with more DIY in 5.